Hello and welcome. We are at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. It's Saturday 3rd of November, which means it's the final late night riding and fireworks of the season. I'm glad you remembered the date. Yeah. I thought it was the second final Saturday of the final season. Final Saturday of the season, unfortunately. Yeah, and a fitting end to the season, really. Icon's got his train lights on. Oh, it's on three trains. I can promise you it's not actually, it's not evening, it's just never gone light. No. It's a bit of a miserable day, really, but... Yeah, it is. Well, I mean, we've, we've been here since opening. It's now, what, about two o'clock? Yeah. Um, yeah, we've done quite a lot of rides on Icon. We've been on Icon a few times. Big Dipper as well. Oh, yeah. We have Rev. speedy pass today. I've been on Rev as well. Yeah. And here we go, Icon. The UK's best roller coaster. Yeah. There is also a lot of folk here from Pleasure Beach Experience. Bit of a takeover. Not everyone's watching though. Not everyone likes a camera like Mike. And Mike Mundy's is making a return soon. Yay! Yeah. This week, hopefully. Yeah. Although that said, it's probably already back by the time this has gone on. Yeah. I've got a slow turnaround of vlogs at the minute. But yeah, we've not started this vlog until now purely because of the rain. And we haven't had a chance. It's been a bit disjointed so yeah. far as well. It's been difficult getting everyone together. A few of us decided to have a lie in this morning. Yeah, they can't oh, handle someone it. Someone didn't. I didn't. I was here in Blackpool for quarter past nine. I was in Blackpool for quarter past nine. Yeah, yesterday. Yes. But they couldn't handle it. I was in Blackpool for quarter past nine. Couldn't handle today. it yesterday. Getting old, mate. Old. I know. Old, I say. has joined us. Nice to be back in Blackpool. I'm very happy to be back in Blackpool, yes. And it's not as cold as Germany. It's not, no, and it's, it, it's quite pleasant actually. I'm, I'm happy, I'm comfortable in my coat. Good stuff. I'm very happy. I'm getting warm. No, you're, you're not. always warm. You're not getting warm. <laughs> man's not cold. Correct. Man's not hot. Yeah, you normally. Hot. So, uh, how was that ride then on Icon? Excellent. Excellent, as always. Oh yeah. Good stuff. It's not quite tarring though, unfortunately. But it's a lot better than Blue Fire. Better than Blue Fire. Yeah, a million times better. You stood here a couple of months ago and said you struggled to separate them. At one point, yeah. Yeah. And yeah. then I looked back and looked back and looked back and thought, yeah, I can see where Icon's better. Yeah, everywhere. Pretty much. Although at least Blue Fire's got better theming, that's what people might say, but I don't care for theming. Really? The launch bit, maybe. That's about it, no, isn't it? Icon's stylerised, I think that's the word. I have like an icon that's far better than Blue Bar. I know Blue Bar was the original Mac Mega. Don't icon. call it a Mac Mega, why well, you ba you're barred. Mac you're barred. Launch. A Mac Mega has a lift hill. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Mac Launch. No, I know Blue Bar was the original Mac Launch, but. Launch! <laughs> launch! <laughs> Swear box! How was your journey from. Uh, it was good until I got to Preston, I got the northern unit. Yeah, the, the, the nodding donkey. I got the nodding donkey, the bus on rails. Uh, yeah, I had to take that yesterday with my six month year old son, and there was nowhere to park a buggy. No. I wasn't sure. happy. You can't park a buggy on them, you can't. Disable like, guests. Can't a wheelchair. Self them. No. And you, you know, if you're, if you're as tall as me, you're sat in the seat, just sort of like that, horizontal. Let, let's get that on the camera, go on, let's have right, it. Okay, no, we'll demonstrate on it. The seat is here. Correct. You're just sat like that. <laughs> Pretty much. I just make myself look like a pelican in front of the crowds. In right. the I know I am, yeah. See, I just napped it off and got a coach instead. It was cheaper and faster. Well, you know, you're tight, so. Yeah. <laughs> it was faster and more comfortable. Well, hopefully, save the money for a Melbourne coast and later on Pop World. <laughs> well, you two stand together, for goodness sake. A group hug or something. 
All right, don't go that far. Don't go that far. Mike's still off shot. So what should we do next then? I'm going to stay on it. What do you say? A roller coaster of some description. A roller coaster of some description. Fortunately, the red one behind you is a little bit out of bounds. Yeah. Well, we're waiting for light for that. So. Yes, we're waiting for it to go dark. Yeah. For queuing two hours, I think it's worth it. Yeah, exactly. Of the big one. I can say with confidence now, whilst that is still one of my favourite posters, Magnum, it's older brother over in Cedar Point. Oh, I thought you were talking about the ice cream for a minute. No, we're not going on about ice cream. It's too cold for ice cream today. Hey, shut the fuck up, I'm Get on camera. <laughs> He's at this time on camera. Yeah, move him on. Yeah, move him on. <laughs> Off you go, Pelican. Right. <laughs> now, so I was saying about the big one. Magnum XL is a better coaster, I can say that with confidence now, but do I still love that? Yes. Yeah. Am I happy that they've got open today? It's a fair bit breezy up there, yes. They're running it well. I think they've got, is it all, all the whole trains open? Yeah, the whole train's open bar in the back row. Yeah. You know, getting people through, really, I've got to give it to them for that. It's only a one train, I can see why. It is very breezy up there today. I could quote Keith Allen, one train's better than none. Exactly. We're getting yeah. the people through, yeah. getting the money. Yeah, so, well, yeah. not quite anymore. It's not a paper no, no, ride. No, it's but not a paper ride, but, you know, a ride, if it's not open, it's still not making money, so. No, correct. Especially when Speedy Pass is concerned. Well, yeah. <laughs> And hoping to do it again in the dark. Hoping to do it again in the dark, so I look forward to it. Excellent. what I was hoping you'd say. Can you stop filming me, please? <laughs> I thought you wanted to be the new Mike. Can anyone, the new Mike. can anyone take over from him? No. Does anyone want to take over? No. Does you want to give up yet? No. All right, well, you're stuck we with it then. <laughs> keep, keep going then. <laughs> no, you're not having a mullet Mondays. <laughs> so you will when he ends up in McDonald's again. I, I, I don't know. You can also just be a tour of weather spoons. Yeah, exactly. I think that's quite a good vlog. I'm not sure about that. But yours is just a tour of McDonald's, is it? Can you two get on camera, please? We have a bit of camera a closer. A tour of McDonald's? No, I'm not so sure. No. We they don't give, need it. Can give you a lecture on how Big Mac's constructed? I can do it. Do you want one? Should we have, should we speak to our do we, viewers? Do we really need this conversation? No, we don't. We just want. didn't be stupid. Yeah. Yeah. So we have joined the queue for Icon in the dark and we've been joined by RCS Reviews. Hiya. Check out the channel. Definitely. <laughs> and yeah, we're doing Icon in the dark for the second time tonight. The queue's moving very quickly. There's lots of PBE members and fans and friends all in the queue together, and it's going to be a lot of fun. Yes. Let's go. Oh, kettle spoiled.
just had three night rides on Icon. They were the best three rides on Icon yet. It's just tonight, it just seems better than ever. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's because it's coming to the end of the season and it just seems better than it actually is. It's just been so good. Me and Mullet did it front row. Oh my God, it's just so good. It's such a great coaster. And as you all know, I've got a bit of an attachment to it. It's helped this channel grow so much. We followed the construction of it from the start. It's just been an amazing journey watching it go from pretty much nothing, from markings on the ground to what it is today. It's an incredible roller coaster, and I absolutely love that it's at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. And I can't wait to do it next year already. And we've still got a day left here yet. But keep an eye out for event information next year. We'll hopefully have an ART on Icon at some point. That is the aim. We don't know if it'll be half an hour or an hour, but that is the aim at some point to do an Icon ERT again, because it's a great coaster, and there's not many things better than to do here than sitting on it for an hour. So that's one thing that we're going to be looking to do next year. One thing I do want to say is that the staff on Icon, from the day it opened, have been absolutely incredible. The operations on it have been stunning. They don't mess about, they get the trains out. If there's any issues with having to swap people over, it's all done very quickly. The seat batching's done quickly, the restraint checks are done quickly, trains are dispatched quickly. It's just amazing what they do. And it's a credit to them all how well the Icon runs. And you see so much praise for them online, whether it's from us, from the general public, other coaster fans. Everybody loves what they do. They are just a great team and they're an absolute credit to Blackpool Pleasure Beach. Ride of the big one. Yeah. Not of the year, but of the day. Nighttime rides. Nighttime rides. Back car for you. Was it worth the 90 minute wait? Oh yeah. yeah. Worth an hour and a half queue all day long. Yeah, good stuff. How was your ride on the big Very one enjoyable. in the dark? Absolutely loved it. Very good to get back on it at dark. It's been quite a long time, so I really enjoyed it. Excellent. And how's your day been overall? Overall fantastic day. Um, just a general fantastic season, um, probably my most memorable, memorable season there. Really good day, good season. Excellent. Let's get the thoughts of Springy Tales. Hello. Was it worth the wait? Yes. Yeah, it was actually. That was awesome. Good stuff. Yeah. Have you had a good day? First, yeah, it's been a good day. That's the first time I've ever done Big One in the Dark. So. Really? Yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm glad you well got to do it then. Yeah. Well, it's been busy today, but the queues have moved pretty fast, I think. Yeah. yeah for, like, the operations are doing really well today. Good stuff. The camera in the queues. Yeah. So, uh, everyone, please subscribe to Springy Tales. Thank you very much. So, I'm covering my eyes because of the camera light. Uh, no, I'll be serious. Uh, we've just had a great last ride of the day on the big one. I am tempted to go and queue for it because I did it on Speedy Pass along with Mullet, whereas Mike and Al and Stevie have queued for it for the 90 minutes. I'm tempted to jump in the queue and do it again because it's running so well, but I'm not sure, even though the staff have got the queue moving really quick for a one train queue, I just don't think I've got the patience for a 90 minute wait in the cold. It wouldn't, it wouldn't matter what ride, what park, I'm just not feeling a 90 minute wait at this time of the year in this kind of weather. But fair play to the big one staff, they've really kept that queue moving and they're really efficient with the speedy pass today as well, getting people on quick, not letting anyone faff around, which people do tend to do when they've got speedy pass, they tend to take the sort of stance of, well, we've jumped the queue, we'll take our time, but people need to get on and get a move on, but the staff have got people getting a move on today, which is good. So a big shout out to the big one staff for today and for the whole season. Also again, big shout out to the Icon staff who have been excellent all year. And just an all-round shout out to the Pleasure Beach staff who take care of their fans, who look after us, who are great people and are enjoyable to work with. So it hasn't been the longest Pleasure Beach vlog of us talking. There's been lots of ride footage in today. Hope you've enjoyed that. Please, if you've enjoyed it, give us a like. Let us know what you think in the comments. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook and Twitter and Instagram and subscribe to us on YouTube. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next Pleasure Beach Experience video.